and welcome back to my channel. I am so glad you guys are here today, okay? Your girl is fully vaccinated. Listen, I think it's like a badge of honor now or something, but if you haven't already, definitely check out my journey while getting my COVID vaccine. I got the Pfizer vaccine, so make sure you guys check it out. I did my first vlogging experience. I did one for the first dose and the second dose, so make sure you guys check it out. So today we are reviewing Steven Baltier's God, where is my Boaz? Okay, where is my Boaz? Where is he at, Lord? With the title alone, God, where is my Boaz? Like, listen, I love this book. So of course, starting from the top, the rating, I definitely give it a 10 out of 10. One of the things that I love about this book is that Steven actually added in questions that some of the women may have asked about this book. Like if they had questions related to whatever topic he was talking about, he added their questions in here and he answered them. And it was just so awesome because there were so many questions I found myself like, wow, that's definitely something I needed help with in that area, you know? Because of course, I'm still single, I'm still mingling. So books like this, are really, really helpful for me, especially in this time of waiting. So of course, you guys already know that he always comes with these titles, always just comes and slays with the titles. So of course, I'm gonna share them with you guys. You need to forgive and heal, then you can love. Hmm. Next chapter, your way isn't God's way. Hmm. Next chapter, you expect God to deliver a man to your doorstep. Hmm. Next chapter, you're too occupied with the wrong man. Ooh, child. The next chapter, you're too focused on what you want. Next chapter, God's already sent your Boaz. You're not embracing him. Child, listen. <laughs> listen, listen, listen. Y'all, when I read that chapter, like, First of all, the title alone, I mean, let me read the title again. God's already sent your Boaz. You're not embracing him. Baby, where? Where, where he at, Lord? Where is he at? Because listen, your girl has been looking, searching high and low. Where is he at, God? Because listen, y'all, I haven't seen him. I don't know where he's at. Lord, re reveal yourself, husband. Reveal yourself, Boaz, because listen, your girl is ready. She's ready, okay? <laughs> so, yes, that chapter is amazing. And then the last chapter is God wants you to focus more on him. Y'all, this book, when I say like for me as a single woman, like it knocked on my door so many times. And when I say knocked on my door, I mean, was all up in my business, okay? I was like, Steven, baby, how did you know? How, how did you know? <laughs> so of course I have to share some quotes that stood out to me. No matter the reason, the principle remains the same. The longer you hold on to a person who isn't for you, the longer you will go without receiving the person who is. Hmm. Child, listen, that's enough for the book review, okay? Listen. <laughs> when I say that quote, like, oh my goodness. Yeah. Pick up the book, okay? <laughs> Another quote that just kind of summarizes what this book is all about um, is this one. And it says, remember that being single is an opportunity for you to learn, grow, and be available for the relationship and man you truly deserve. That's literally what this book is about. Like he goes through, you know, the preparation, like how to prepare for your Boaz, you know, things that you need to do, like steps that you need to take in order to clear the path for your Boaz. This book, I mean, I have to read it again. I even told my best friend that I have to read this book again because it is just so, real it's so transparent it's so relatable like there was so many stories in this book so many questions in this book that literally just spoke to me so if you are single if you are on the journey to find your boaz are you if you're waiting for your boaz 
pick up this book. All right, well, that's all I have for you guys. I hope that you enjoyed this book review. Don't forget to order this book. It is so good. He has a ton of books, so definitely check him out. He's on Instagram, YouTube, everywhere, so check him out. And don't forget to like, subscribe, share, and comment below. I would love to hear from you guys. If you haven't read the book, or even if you have, definitely comment below. All right, stay tuned for my next videos. I'm bringing back some more story times because I know you guys enjoy those. So until next time, peace.